right up here is Jupiter. In the most volcanically active place in the solar system, the moon Io is passing behind it right now. Let's go to the telescope. All right, I see three of the moons. Do we see the fourth? Oh, there it is. Do you see it? We're catching this right at the right time. We got to zoom in. Hi, Jupiter. Hi, Io. So Io is the little dot coming out from behind Jupiter, and it's orbiting around Jupiter. Little history lesson here. So back in the 1600s, Galileo first observed these four large moons of Jupiter, okay? But later in the 1600s, a Danish astronomer, Ole Romer, he started observing Io, much like we are tonight, and he started noting down the intervals in between each orbit of Io around Jupiter he noticed something. The closer Earth got to Jupiter, the shorter those intervals, and the further away, the longer those intervals. And in timing those delays, he proved that light has a finite speed. It's not infinite. Not too bad in the 1600s with a notebook, telescope, and observing it just like we are here tonight. And that became a cornerstone of physics. Wow. How cool was that, right? All right, guys, wanted to share that with you. Get out, check out the night sky. We'll see you soon.